back to the channel. Um, this is the four, first kind of summer um, transfer talk we're going to be talking about today. Um, you know, um, obviously the season's over by the time you're watching this video, um, which is great. Um, I can't believe like, I'm saying these words, but you know what? I'm happy the season's over. I'm very happy. Um, you know what? <sighs> right, I've discussed... I've, you probably watched the the Hibs review after that game. Now I never had time for the the preview, guys. I was doing something else. But anyway, I'm back for this video, guys. And this first summer transfer talk video, and it is about um, we're going to go for Celtic are considering summer swoops for Hibs striker Kevin Nisbet, which we fate will face, and former Hearts left back Aaron Hickey. Um, I'm still in two minds with Nisbet, but Hickey would definitely be a solid addition. I think. Um, I think he'd be really good. Um, you know, you've seen you've seen him. Um, you've seen him be longer. Um, he's I think he's really good. Some of the clips I've seen of him, he's really good. Um, on the other hand, Kevin is, but I'm in the middle. Um, obviously, Hibs. Um, whoa, sorry about that. Maybe the camera cut us out. Hibs obviously a decent side. Um, finished. Uh, I think they finished third in the league this season. Um, but um, it'd be a 50 50 me, obviously, Eddie Howe. It's his own decision. But obviously, we sp you speak about on episode one of the Sco Let's Talk About Scottish Football. Um, we talked about uh, uh, Marciano from Hibs, potentially, because it's his last. It's his, well, it's him over with Hibs. Um, potentially, we could go for him if Barkas is going back to AK Athens. Potentially. Or if Eddie Howe wants him. You know, who's doing these signs? Is Eddie Howe already in? We do not know. Is this announcement going to come? We do not know either when this will come. Um, but it's interesting to see these new so first kind of looks at what this summer's going to look like transfer wise you know i like the sound of Mickey in the middle with kevin and um, this bit but um a striker is definitely on the list because you're talking like if it if you're yeah definitely edwards going this summer um and then you're talking potentially griffith's going maybe he's already finished um so you're saying you're saying at the most you definitely need a striker there's you're, you're talking a yeti as your own striker um, some fans might be alright with that um, but I would like another striker to the addition I don't think what, one striker's not enough obviously uh, you'd have to bring somebody up from the youth um, which we don't have we don't have a good youth system since Kian Tierney that was the last good youth player we're starting to get into like Montgomery and young Karamoko they only two really in Welsh as well but you know a good player you've seen progress further and the team has started you know what I mean except for maybe Welsh because it's obviously Duffy you know? let's not talk about Duffy you know uh, but you know, except from that, there's not been any, um, which I feel is disappo very disappointing. You know, um, since Tierney, um, you know, you're talking wild back. You know, he obviously moved to Arsenal. Um, he's playing good for them, but um, you know, you know, you know, you're talking that, and then you're talking Aaron Hickey's a left back. So you're talking obviously Diego Laxalt is going back to AC Milan, and I don't surely be Christ. Celtic's not going to go for a lax up on a, 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 a permanent. I think they're talking like 8 million, 9 million for them a permanent. I don't think they'll go for it. I really don't. I hope they don't. Um, I don't think they will. Um, I think it was the news the other week. They were not going to go for it. But um, on that note, you know, talking Greg Taylor, it's a solid left back. You know, he's a solid left back. Um, maybe potentially Anne Hickey's going for a, you know, maybe back up or a first team. We don't know. Um, but it's interesting to see those transfers. Um, I'll bring you up to date and any news that's going to come probably now, guys, because it's the end of the season. Um, when you're watching this video, of course. Um, I'll bring you up to date with any of the news that's going to come out. Probably we'll rank the kits when they come out. You know, the new kits are starting to come out. Um, we'll talk a bit more in the discussion of season tickets and Eddie Howe. Hopefully he's announced. Come on, fingers crossed, come on. And um, a lot more uh, transfers. That's a good question, though. If, for example... Is Eddie Howe in the behind the scenes? Is he already there? Waiting to or waiting? So say, for example, um, to Monday morning um, and announcing Eddie Howe and then they're going to bring the season ticket out. So that, 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 you know, because they're talking about these transfer rumours, you know. Uh, we're talking about these transfer rumours. Who's doing them? If it's not Eddie Howe, who's doing it? I'm, I'm, I'm still on the submission it's Eddie Howe. Um, my camera keeps freezing. I don't know why it's doing that. Maybe bad Wi-Fi. I don't know. But, um, 
Both of you guys' video is okay. Um, but thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe and like, and I'll keep you up to date with any new um, transfer news or anything that comes out with Celtic and stuff. Um, until then, guys, peace.